this is a test just to see what the audio sounds like on this all right so look at me i'm a right state so uh it's been a while since you saw what just happened well it's been a while since what you just saw happened and um i was going to recording two channels started my uh i, I was going to try and keep doing these videos um because i thought it would be useful helpful and I haven't. Um, so this morning I've got the third part of my autism assessment. <clears throat> I've had the first two parts already. It happened really quickly. Um, the first part was really it was my mum had to be sort of quizzed um, and I spoke to the lady afterwards for a bit um, and then the second bit was the same lady uh, just me and now I'm I've come to this place for my third part which is with a different lady somebody I've not met before and it's in it's face to face <clears throat> um, I've I've got like from the time that I thought you know that I realized well that you know what just happened in that in those videos where I realized I was autistic or thought thought I realized I was autistic I've spent time quite a lot of time in um, like researching and um, I've been on like interacting with neurodivergent people on threads and things like that um, and uh, I, I keep going either side of the fence uh, as for yeah I'm autistic or no I'm not autistic um, and, and the last sort of few weeks has just been like that constantly going either side um i still think i am really uh ultimately but i guess this thing i'm about to go and do now is is going to be the final part of uh you know working that out i don't know if i get an answer today the previous two things i had the lady said yeah you you are pretty much she all but confirmed that i was but obviously this is a, i need to have all parts and have to have a an official like you know report done or whatever well that that will happen after this thing today i'm really anxious uh i'm a bit grumpy i mean i'm in a bad i'm in a bad mood um and, I, and it's mostly led by anxiety about this. Um, yeah. I don't know what the time is, but I've got about twenty. I've got about twenty minutes. Um, I mean, it, it is what it is. I've got to do it to find out one way or another, uh, which is what I wanted to know. I wanted to know one way or another. I think, um, yeah, I guess I'm anxious because it's a face to face um, and I'm gonna have to be like open and, uh, you yeah. know, talk about myself and whatever so that's stressful uh 
also I don't know the person it's it, 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 it's somebody I have no um, uh, experience in My mum's in Australia. That was that was her. My mum. Yeah. So I'm going to do another video when I come out of this place. Uh, as soon as I've finished. Probably when I get back to this car. Um, just to get my immediate thoughts on what happened in there. Um, so that might be emotional. Mm, wait and see, I guess. All right, I'm back. Do I have anything to say? Not really. Um, still none the wiser, really. It was, um, it was all right. It was talking about me, and there were some things in there that she asked me to do, which I don't fully understand. Um, one of them was a book. She gave me a book, which was a, sh a small. Um, thin paperback book called I think it was called Tuesday and it was essentially just pictures about these frogs on lily pads that were flying she asked me she asked me she said look at this and tell me what you know tell me what the what the story is or, or what the message is And I did. I, I didn't know. I didn't. These frogs were flying. I mean, this doesn't make sense, right? It's the frogs. Frogs don't fly. Um, and they're on. They were on these lily pads, and it was like they were flying. And and it started in the evening. There was a bit of print Tuesday at you know Tuesday evening or something like that. And these frogs were frogs were flying about and. And then the next one on another page, it said uh, 11 p.m. And it was this bloke in the kitchen eating a sandwich and the, fl the frogs were looking at him through the window. And then the next page, it went on and they were flying about a bit more. Um, and then it showed the frogs coming away from their like leaving their lily pads and going back into the river uh, and the next page there was a police detective like looking at clues and there was all these lily pads on the floor and then it showed a barn and there was no frogs it was a barn and there was a weird it looked like back end of a of a of an animal up in the sky it was just weird i don't, I don't understand i could i couldn't make sense of it i couldn't i couldn't i couldn't i felt like i couldn't answer the question that she asked me which i think was what's happening here what's the story well, it isn't a story so that was weird. I, d I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know what that means. And there was this other thing where she had a load of different items. She pulled them out of her bag and random things. There was a, right, okay, random things. And she chose, she said, um, I'm going to give you an example here. Uh, I'm going to pick three of these items and, and sort of make a story up about them. And then I want you to do do that, but pick like five items, different items. And I, 
got so uh, <laughs> I'm 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 stopped in my track tracks now trying to explain it because that's what happened when I had to do it because I I'm just trying to think well, why what what do these items mean what what is it you understand by me picking whatever I'm going to pick how do I make a story out of them I feel like this is something that I'm not good at um so I chose some items but I I chose items which I had some kind of relation to I picked a car and a, a playing card and a, a pair of glasses um a bouncy ball but I couldn't make a story up about them. like none of those items go together um they're different sizes that they're not the correct sizes the scale in relation to each other is is off so that was something i i, I couldn't really i don't feel like i understood what she meant or if i i get i don't know i just don't know um that was a weird thing she asked me lots of questions and i felt like there was so much more i could have told her or she, but i just didn't get asked those questions and then there was other questions where she would um you know tell me about something things that make you angry well I mean, or annoyed, like lots of things make me annoyed or angry. I guess the things do make me angry, but what? I can't, I mean, I felt like I was on the spot and I, and I couldn't, I couldn't, um, I couldn't even think of the answers, let alone tell her, tell her what the answers were. Some of them I could, um. It was yeah. anyway. She said it will be like no. She said ten days. Ten days is what she said. So when it gets to the tenth day, I'll be looking at my watch, going right. Where is it? The report. Uh, I just feel like this. I, I said, any any clues? And she's like, no, not really. Um, we can't do that. We have to go and all talk and, um, you know, speak about everything we've learnt about you. Um, and then we will give give a response. I guess. So I just gotta wait a bit longer. 